I'm James Williams with Discovery News. I recently sat down with the first family of tropical meteorology, Robert Simpson and his wife, Joanne Simpson. Joanne Simpson has had one incredible career. She not only helped figure out what drives hurricanes, but she also helped develop the first cloud models. Here, sitting next to her husband, she talked to me a little bit about her life's work. I'm Joanne Simpson, and I study the hurricane heat engine and what makes it go and what makes it not go. When I was a teenager, I had no idea about going into meteorology. And when World War II broke out, I just wanted to enlist, so to speak. And I was given an offer to finish college and to pay my way if I went in meteorology as a student to teach the large numbers of people that were being trained in meteorology in those days. I was the first woman to ever get a PhD in meteorology. Now the over half of the graduate students in the field are women and this makes me very, very happy. First work I ever did about hurricanes was about how some stratospheric air gets into them, but mostly it's the ocean and ocean heat supply that, that makes the hurricane heat engine go. People thought when Bob and I got married that we'd be in competition with each other and the marriage wouldn't last more than two years and they took bets on it, we found out later. And now we're in our 45th year of our marriage and five children and six grandchildren. And we, I don't think we've ever had a, any competition between the two of us. It's one of us putting in an idea and another one developing it and going back and forth. You, I, I read that at one point you originally wanted to be an astrophysicist. If you, if you were in your early 20s now, would you still be a meteorologist? That would be very, very tempting to be, try to be an astrophysicist. Uh, I got interested in both fields, really, and because of World War II, I became a meteorologist. I, I would like to, if I could do it again, I'd do just the same again.